Welcome to another One Love Review, and we have another Dash product for you. So, you guys love the popcorn maker. Um, a lot of people have been viewing that video, and we love the popcorn maker. Um, but if you watch that review, we sort of had issues with the butter. So, you're supposed to put the butter on top of the popcorn maker, and we put it too thick. They said cut it thinner. We're like, you know, instead of doing all that, what if there's something we can just use to put butter on it? Right. Dad said, you know what? We got you covered. You bought our popcorn maker, so we got this butter sprayer. So we got the Dash butter sprayer, and we're going to try it out on some popcorn Good. and see if it solves that issue of the butter melting on the popcorn. I feel like this way it's more evenly spread. Yeah. Agreed. So we ain't going to hold you. Let's look at this box and get it open. All right. It's pretty okay. straightforward. Mm -hmm. We got the blue. She likes blue, so I got the blue. They have white, red. Let's see. Melt your heart. Charges, grease, lightning, serving store, shellfish, roasted corn, pancakes. Yeah. You can use it for everything. I'll probably use it to, like, butter my waffles. That's good. Because, you know, you put waffles in, they come out, like, hard. And it's hard to put the yeah, butter and spread it through all yeah. the little holes. So now you can spray Great. it on everything and be even. That, that sounds good. Huh. What is that? I don't know. <laughs> Happy with your purchase. If so, we're glad to hear that. If you're a small team that cares, please share the love by posting a review to help other customers. Well, that's exactly what we are doing. You got that Dash. right, Jack. And here we have, I'm pretty sure this is instructions. So I'm going to pass the instructions over to the instruction person. Even though she's been slacking a little. <laughs> Okay, so we have the base plate here, the charge it up, the charging base plate, little LED, what is that? I don't know what it is. We'll see what that is when we get to it, but that's the LED thing, I think. No, it shows all of the Dash products, too. Oh, I got several, I'm pretty sure. Mm-hmm. All right. See we got here. Okay, remove the cap from the main body by unscrewing it counterclockwise, 90 degrees. Place one to eight uh, tablespoons of butter into the melting chamber. It is recommended to only melt as much butter as will be used. This is what I was telling my husband. You say um, you, you spin, do the spin and rooney to open it. Ah, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. twist. Counterclockwise, 90 degrees. Got a little holy thing there. All right, okay, okay. Then the bottom here, you got the little three things for the, okay, okay. So, how much you gonna put in there, girl? Uh, we'll use two tablespoons you want. Um, you know what? Like the NFL used to say back in the day, you make the call. We'll use two. Got a body here. Back plug her in, plug her in. And clearly we're gonna put something in here, so I'm going to rinse it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, yeah, there's, there's a little blue LED light right here, the indicator. Make sure y'all can see that. You got your lid. I'm interested to see how this is going to work. I tell you. Okay. Okay. Plug the charging base into a wall socket, which you did. The power indicator light will illuminate blue. Illuminate blue. Place your butter sprayer on the charging base oh. to begin charging and melting butter. So it's going to melt yellow. butter, the power indicator light. So you have to put the butter in now, because that's what it's doing. It's actually, if the butter was there right in there now, it would be melting the butter. The power light, uh, the power indicator light on the charging base will change to orange. The charging melting indicator light on the butter spray will illuminate orange. This indicates the butter spray is melting butter. Okay, so it's orange, but there was, you made a mess. <laughs> So it's not the size of the the butter when you cut it. So, but you can just push it down in there. It's gonna get the sides off. But 
pretty sure that'll melt and go in. Just wipe off the outside. He means we didn't put a whole stick of butter. Yeah. You don't have to cut it. You just put a whole stick of butter. But it says only use with how much butter you're going to use. So we have the girls tonight and we made them popcorn. So we're going to make enough to spray on the popcorn. Hopefully. Try and see how this thing works. Right. We might have to melt more butter. I don't know. Got that right, Jack. Oh, this is very, very interesting. But as you can see, we got our orange indicator here and the blue. Whoa. What happened? I hear it. It says when the charging melting indicator light begins blinking blue, this indicates that your butter is partially melted. It's blinking and blue. the butter sprayer is ready to be used for short spraying periods. Important, it is recommended to wait until your butter is fully melted as this will prevent clogging of your butter sprayer. Okay. Yeah, so, so we'll wait. Yeah, We're not in a rush. No, it's blinking already. We didn't put a lot of butter, so it shouldn't take too long. I mean, that was pretty quick. It's already blinking. Okay, so it's still blinking. Mm -hmm. It says when the charging melting indicator light stops blinking and is solid blue, your butter is fully melted and the butter sprayer is ready for use. Okay, I think I, like I, figured, I figured out what this little thing is on the back. It's an extra nozzle. It's a, um, if you look on this side... The nozzle for the butter spray is right here, and that's the exact same thing that's here. So they give you an additional one, and it goes out on the base plate and just screws right on. And I didn't even need the instruction book to tell me that. Mm, let's see if that. Let's see if he's right. <sighs> there it is, right there. That's not what it says. Oh, that is. Yeah. Uh, Spare spray nozzle. <laughs> In denial. I was right without the, the instructions. Yeah. All right. So oh, it's all blue now. So I guess that means it's melted. It's melted. It says if it's solid blue, it's melted. Bring in the popcorn, baby. Baby. So we already popped some popcorn. Maybe I in should our butt a hug. Okay, so nozzle triggered. Let's see what it does. Do you just hold it? Mm-hmm. Or maybe it's not charged, I don't know. But it's not it's not spraying. Your power indicator light on the charging base, which okay, um <laughs> when you have finished spraying, point the butter sprayer's nozzle at the item you wish to spray and press the spray button to release. Do not point the butter sprayer at face and eyes or at the horse. Maybe it needs to charge some more. Because it did nothing. Well, why don't you uh, open it and see if the butter's melted? I mean, that's not rocket science. Not all the way. Not all the way. I don't know why it turned blue if it's not all the way. So we'll let it, we'll let it uh, melt some more. And while we wait for this to melt, well, this one's gonna take you what, maybe three, two, one seconds, and then it's gonna be melted already. So this has a note. It says storing your butter sprayer in the refrigerator will keep your butter fresh for longer. You do not need to replace the butter after every use. You only need to replace the butter if the butter has spoiled. Oh. So it's so basically a butter tray too. So put your butter in it, melt it, use it, yeah. and put it in the refrigerator to, yeah. to keep it fresh. Yeah. It also says it is recommended to place the butter sprayer on the charging base for an hour after first use. This will fully charge the butter sprayer for future use. Gotcha. So it's brand new. We've never charged it before. Mm -hmm. So we don't want to give it a thumbs down because it didn't work. Um, clearly, it's not charged. No. And two, it still needs to melt some more. So... We're going to give it time to charge and melt, and yeah, in the next couple of seconds, you'll see if it works or not. Oh, look at this, though. It says your butter sprayer comes with an automatic safety shutoff feature that will activate if the butter sprayer is left charging for more than an hour. This will turn the heating element off, and your butter will cool and harden. Oh. That's pretty good, especially, you know, us busy moms and single dads cooking. as well. If you're in the kitchen and you have to run and get something or do mm -hmm. something and you forget that this is on there, it has that uh, feature, which yeah. is really nice. Good safety feature. Mm -hmm. So you ain't burning up nothing. Yeah. 
Okay. We're going to let this thing chargey, chargey, melty, melty. So we're at solid blue. Butter is completely melted and butter sprayer is ready for use. That's what it says. Yeah, but it's not. Mm -hmm. It's not. So we're going to leave it be for a little bit longer. So here are all the little indicator symbols. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's pretty neat. Mm -hmm. It's hardening and it needs to be reheated. Let me show. Let me show. Let me show them now. That's pretty neat. So the, the chart shows all the different stages of the the butter. Butter. Mhm. Mm it tells you when it needs to be reheated. Low battery. The um, issue with battery. Oh. Stop use, stop use immediately when it's solid red. So that blinking is what? Blinking orange or blinking all colors. It looks like all colors, right? Mm-hmm. Like it's trying to blink blue. Well, right now it's orange and pink. Because I pushed the, push the button. I don't know. It doesn't show that. It doesn't mean low battery. Just being nosy, let's see. Oh, that's it's pretty belted. Yeah, but not completely. It's no. only two tablespoons of butter. I could have heated this up in the in a pan. Well, I'm pretty sure if you've already had butter in it and then you're just reheating it, it'd probably be faster. Cause that was cold out the refrigerator. I don't know. I don't know. That's an excuse. Maybe. Oh, orange, it, it says butter sprayer is connected to the base. That's for this? Yeah. That's so this, that. This. No, this. Oh, the butter. Yeah. Well, I don't know why all this. these colors are happening there. Because yeah. there's so multiple these, colors. These it's like colors pink, represent. blue, and orange. Yeah, and me, I have no clue what. Let me turn it around so the people can see it. I have no clue what that means. But the ones up here is orange and blue. Yeah, That's yeah. for this LED for the yeah, base. Yeah. I mean, I hear it, but it's not doing anything. It wasn't nothing we needed to do prior to using it, was it? No, I read everything. It was really simple. Oh. What are you doing? Why are you taking it apart? I'm just checking. Okay, so it did come with these little styrofoam things. I think these are just for insulation. It goes around the, the sprayer. So it just goes on the sprayer here like and so. And you're not supposed to touch it. You're not supposed and, to open it. And then you put that back on. And this is for when you're changing out the nozzle. So, because the nozzle can be changed out. Perfect. Yeah, step one, remove the cap. That's what you did. Mm -hmm. You put the butter, mm -hmm. you locked it back in, mm -hmm. you put it on the base, mm -hmm. it charges and starts melting, mm -hmm. and solid blue is ready. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's it. And it's not spraying. Well, I, I know you're not holding the sprayer. Yeah. Right, so if it does start spraying, it's going to spray that way. But it's not spraying at all, so... Dash, what have you done to me? Come on, Dash. Mm. I'm sort of sad. Yeah, so show them that. That's how it's supposed to look, but. It's, uh, not. it's supposed to have a misty spray, misting spray of butter. But yeah, we ain't getting that right now. We ain't getting that. Yeah, it's kind of disappointing. I'm kind of disappointed. Yeah. Cause like I said, it's melted. Ah. Yeah, it's not, it's not spraying. It should be spraying by now. I mean, the butter, there's, it's like it's melted. Ninety percent melted, so yeah. it should be spraying. Yeah, I mean. Yeah, that's melted. So where where is it gonna co be coming from? Where is the no? The yeah, where is the? I think the things in here, in the bottom. So it goes where's in. the sprayer here? Yeah, that's the sprayer here. Yep, 
Yeah, dash, I don't know. Maybe we have to leave it on there and let it charge up some more. I don't even hear nothing trying to charge. Okay, what time is it? 7.22. Yeah. So we'll give it to what, 7.35? That's and pushing by it. by 7.35, it doesn't do anything, it's not for me. Yeah. I'm have to because see I could message. melt butter in the microwave mm -hmm. and be done. Mm -hmm. All right, so five, four, three, two, one. So, <laughs> y'all can't see a white tag mm -hmm. <laughs> with a butter sprayer. <laughs> okay. okay, so we didn't take the whole full time to do it. It actually, I, I just came over here and hit the button and it actually worked. So he did what I told him not to do, so it sprayed all over the counter. Doesn't matter. So, we are ready to try this butter sprayer out and um, see what it can do. So, it's good and melted and uh, now it don't want to work. You know what? I think it's not charged because if I put it on the base, it, oh wow, oh. It definitely uh, sprayed it. Huh. I didn't mean to do that. So it sprayed. I mean, it sprayed a lot too. Taste it, baby. See if it got on there. Now, you want me to spray it again? Yeah. So it is that we didn't charge it. So it's not charged. So when I take it off the base, it's not charged enough to it goes out. But if I leave it on the base while it's charging, oh, it sprays. But I think we should have put more butter in it. No, it doesn't need more butter. It's probably that's it. That's what I let it use. But it works. Yeah, it but works. the thing is, it's not charged. You don't need to add more butter. Um, but dig it. Okay. I can't hey, get in that bottle. all over the place, though. <laughs> you just gotta pick it up. Um, I don't know if I'll use this to tell you the truth. If it needs maybe, to be charged. Well, if it's charged fully and it doesn't take no time, mm -hmm. um, then maybe, but. If I have to use the base just to charge yeah, this. Yeah, you don't have I, to use the I'm, base. It's just, we just took it out the box, so it does need to charge. I think that's the only issue. But once it's but charged. But it's misleading. It's misleading yeah. because it has a solid blue line. Yeah, so it's saying that it's charged, but as soon as I take it off and press the button, the blue light goes off and it doesn't work. And then it blinks saying that it's not charged. Yeah. We'll see. So there's a question mark beside this one. We might have to do a follow-up review and see how it works after we charge it. We'll see. I'm not impressed. It's hard to be impressed when it ain't working the way it's supposed to. So I'm just going to hold out till we do the follow-up review. So stay tuned for Dash Fault Review. And hopefully it's just a charging issue. If not, Dash... I'm going to need a refund on that split. Mm -hmm. So she's eating. She's hungry. So we're going to wrap this up. And for now, we're going to have to give it a wait and see. No, she's giving it donuts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm giving it a wait and see. You're I want to see, it, I I see it charged and see if it does what it's supposed to. Okay. Because just like this, it's fine. I mean, it's, I mean, it's spraying good. I mean, it's a good, nice mist. And that was, look at that. I mean, based on that, I love it. I just don't like having to hold the base to use it. See that? I don't like waiting so long to use it either. The popcorn pops faster than the butter heats up. Yeah. So, till the next review, please like, subscribe, and share. And uh, I'm hoping this works. I don't. I don't like to have bad products. I mean, we've had. We haven't had many. Be honest mm -mm. so i hope this one pulls through at the last second but if it doesn't i'll use it one more time if he has it fully charged by the time we come again i'll use it if not i just don't have time for that my kitchen has to be efficient for me i have to be able to move along not sit here and wait for something this is the way 
So till next one, peace, love, and do things. Really? <laughs> Knock you out.